Welcome back to our live webcast for our Starlink mission. Now we're close to the end of today's mission. We had an on-time liftoff at 3.01 p.m. Eastern time, successfully recovered our first stage booster, and our second stage, which you can see on your screen now, had two successful ignitions and shutdowns of its Merlin vacuum engine. Coming up shortly, we'll see payload deployment of the Starlink satellites. Now, during the 15 minutes since our last burn, the second stage has picked up a small rotation intentionally to help us separate out the satellites after payload deployment. And uh, once the satellites have separated from the spacecraft, they will continue on with the rest of their mission, ultimately ending up in an operational orbit about 550 kilometers above the Earth. Fantastic shot of the payload separating away with the horizon of planet Earth. So shortly from here, the Starlink satellites will deploy their solar arrays, and then over the next few days and weeks, they'll use their onboard ion thrusters to make their way into an operational orbit. And that's going to bring our webcast coverage to a close. Close. Uh, we want to give a big thanks to the range and the Federal Aviation Administration for supporting today's mission. Now, if you're interested in Starlink service, head on over to starlink.com to find out more details. Thank you so much for joining us, and may the 4th be with you.